Uh, okay, let, I'll just chop the chop my my own floor there for a second. There we go. Look at that. Okay, can I? There we go. Grab. Ah, damn goblins! Quit taking my stuff, you dirty goblins, you. Okay, those are all five, five out of six. Okay, these are all still new. You dirty goblins took a lot of my crops, as a matter of fact. Uh, all right, let's, let's dig these holes up. Dirty goblins. Why you gotta, why, why you gotta do that, goblins? I mean, what I ever do to you? All right, so I have a bunch of mangoes and some gooseberries. Everything else got raw, uh, got stolen. Uh oh, looks like one of your plants has come down with a case of jelly flies. You should probably head down to the clinic as soon as possible and see if Bumble Shaft can help me. I have a case of jelly flies. Wait, how do I? Which one has the jelly flies? Healthy, 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 healthy. They all say healthy. I don't know. But you know what I do know? I know I see this bamboo right here. And I see this bamboo. Good lord! Come on! Takes a million hits to kill some uh, uh, to kill these things off. And like others it takes like one or two hits. It's like can you make up your mind please? All right. <clears throat> Is that? Yes, it is. Just barely saw the edge of it. All right, let's put away. That is enough. So let's grab this, grab out the iron, grab out the shrubs. All right, so that's enough. No more, no more. Goblins do many things, but they would never disrespect a sign. Use this to politely signal that goblins aren't welcome. Inventory is full. <sighs> Just put that in there for a minute. Uh, what am I doing? Crafting this. All right. Really? Okay. So, uh, hold on. Hold that thought. We can go right here and go like that. And then put it right there. Achievement unlocked. Get off my lawn. Well, that is a very small sign. So I can now, I understand now why, like one of the skills, what is it, is it a skill or is it um, a research? One of the uh, researches or something like that is like a bigger, what is it, a bigger one or something like that? Like a bigger sign? Yeah, better, uh, better, uh, better's goblin scare. may not be an awful idea. Because that is tiny. That's a tiny area. All right, let me go grab my, my, my stuff again. Grab these out. Uh, put these back. Uh, let's go ahead and turn this in since we're, uh, since it's on the way. Um, let's give her the first 
Well, actually, hold on. Um, we can check right here. Uh, what is it? Down here. Garden shop. Had to make a, ser a separate journal page. Okay, so it's its own journal page. Which is what? Plant medic? No. Each, what, what's the... Had to make a separate journal page to keep track of the plants. The recipes? Echipedia? Props? No. Gotta grow them all? Gotta grow them all. Okay, so... Okay, so she doesn't actually care if they are special or not. She just wants one of everything, period. Okay, well, unfortunately, my Aki, I think, got robbed. So we will go ahead and put th this and this in there. We'll go give her a gooseberry. Actually, let's go one, two, three, and we'll give her one of the gooseberries. All right, let's grab up all of the forage we can. For example, that. Grab all the forage. I don't even know, I can't even spot it half the time, but we're just gonna walk through everything. This grass does a wonderful job of hiding things. Not to mention the trees. Oh, oh, no, that's... Oh, wait. Is there anything on the beach? Doesn't look like it. Oh, that's a... No, that's... Okay. Uh... Forage, 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 forage. All right. Then we will go to you first. All right, and hey, Joe, I have some crops for your comp compost. And there you go. Thank you so much. And then we go to Mikey. There you go. Eeny, mine, eeny, mine, Joe. And here, take that and take that. All right. And I still have a little bit extra for, uh, for some... For a little energy, which I think I'm just going to go ahead and eat because I'm hungry. <laughs> Maybe. Am I hungry? Yes, I am hungry. <laughs> Ooh, my nose is itchy. <laughs> All right, so what was the next thing we needed to do? I can't remember anything. We still need to figure out this whole top screw thing. <laughs> do you think maybe the top screw thing is going to be in the jungle? All right, well, let's go talk to Bumble Shaft. <laughs> oh. Got another... Cool. Got another research point. <laughs> uh, one research point. Good. All right, so... Buttons. Let's see. What do we... I mean... I mean, you know? Um... <laughs> animal Starter Pack. Get started keeping livestock with this nifty Animal Starter Pack. Kind of tempted. Lights. You no longer have to fear the dark. Fences. Nice. Really tempted with that. Water. Oh, water features, hedges. Wait, sprinklers maybe? Water pump? Sprinkler! Hmm. I mean, sprinklers are kind of a thing. Kind of an important thing. Unfortunately, you kind of have to... 
you kind of have to dig your way through two relatively pointless things in order to get to the sprinklers and then upgraded sprinklers and serious sprinklers. <laughs> uh... I'm going to get the well. Sprinklers are kind of a big deal. All right, so we have another homesteading, which let's do. There we go. Let's do crops immunity. Natural immunity. Oh, each level decreases. Okay, so that's that's actually fun. You can do that. Oh, you, so every level gets a little bit better. Okay, good to know. So no, no, and no, and no. Okay. Uh, let's get out of here. I need to talk to Mr. Bumblebrains. Mr. Bumblebrains, where are you? You're like over, you have like a a little cross, a little, little red cross symbol on your building. I really need to get to, uh, to learn this place better. That's the, I thought it was over here. I would, I swear this, this, this town is moving. I mean, I, I it's, it's dumb and I realize it's not doing that. But I would swear that this, 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 this whole town up and just moves itself around. I mean, it's probably just my jumbled memory. I mean, everybody knows that I have a terrible memory. What is this? Oh, okay, that's you. <sighs> Can we have a better map than this? For those of us, uh, th those of us, <laughs> I can't even talk today. For those of us who have bad memories and we maybe just have, there we go. You're up here? When were you up here? All right. Hello, Mr. Bumbleshaft. Hello, Joe. One of my plants is sick. Sorry to hear that, Joe. What's wrong with it? It's got a bad case of jellyflies. Can you help? Ah, the jellyflies. And you're sure it's not just faking it? Um, yes, I'm fairly confident. On account of it being a plant and all. Oh, yeah, right. It pains me to say this, but I'm actually fresh out of plant medicine. I should get a new shipment tomorrow, though. Oh, no. What should I do then? Well, the thing about plant diseases is that they're highly contagious. So you have two choices. Either you leave it alone until my shipment comes in tomorrow, or risk it uh, infecting other plants. Or you cut it down. That'll obviously kill the plant, but at least the disease won't spread. Oh, what do you think I should do? I'm a doctor, no, uh... <laughs> Damn it, Joe, I'm a doctor, not a fortune teller! You'll have to decide on your own. Fair point. Is there anything else I should know? In life in general, or regarding plant diseases? Uh, plant diseases right now, please. Very well. There are three types of known plant diseases on peach leaf. Jellyflies, as you've already encountered, the blues, and bubble disorder. They all have different uh, symptoms and require different types of medicine. If a plant is lonely, there's a higher risk of it getting the blues. If there are a lot of plants around it, then there's a higher risk of it contracting the jellyflies. And finally, if it's raining, there's a higher chance of your planets co contracting bubble disorder. And the only options I have are to either cut down the plant or come here and buy medicine for it. For now, yes, I'm sure that down the line you'll figure out how to create the medicine for them yourself. All right, thanks for your help, doctor. I might be back tomorrow to stock up on plant drugs. 
You're always welcome, Joe. See you around. Uh, and, and in the meantime, you've got, yeah, just the health potions. And I've got this pretty sweet carrot. Did I did I already give him a pretty sweet carrot? Uh Yeah, okay, so yeah, there's not an option, so there ya. Okay. Let's take a look at what we got here. I still need to figure out this whole top screw thing. Something tells me I need to go into the jungle and find it there. So I think I might do that. Uh, the Akuba, yeah, we need a lot of money. I think we're just gonna need to get a lot of money. Uh, we're working, oh, yeah, I need seeds. Aki and I, and then they ate my seeds, damn it. Um, Forage life for me. Yeah, I already did all that. Um, yeah. And then plant. Yeah, I gotta wait for the medicine. Uh, we're giving her, yeah, the stuff. Uh, okay, it wasn't so scary after all. Uh, I met a friendly, if, uh, okay, granted I don't know adventure is actually part of his name. Uh, he managed to help me out and get some iron. No, no more stealing. For, okay, so I, I did that. I did get off my lawn. So, I mean, is there more to this? Hmm. Okay. Well... I guess for now, let, let's let see if maybe this is just a matter of, oh, oh boy. Spinzy! Thank you for the raid. Squeaker says thank you. Welcome in, raiders. This is my raid message. Hello, raid message. It is good. It is a good raid message. It is powerful. It is in. It is. It is. Oh, it is a level up. Um. Here, let me get to. A, <laughs> let me get to a place where time is no longer moving. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. You need a. You need a raid message. You know, something like mine with the lion raid and all the emotes and things. You know. But welcome in, Spinzy Raiders. I am Squeaking Lion. If you don't know uh, know who I am, I'm me. And uh, I am a variety gamer, and I do a whole lot of uh, a wide variety of video games. And today we are playing Peach Leaf Pirates, uh, which is turning out to be kind of like what happens when you have Stardew Valley and uh, Curse of Monkey Island, like smash together and and making a baby and it created peach leaf pirates it's clever it's it's got a lot of funny uh, parts to it the gameplay is is quite good and i'm finding myself actually genuinely engaged with this um and so far we're having a lot of fun with it um how was your raid spinzy what'd you play what'd you do what'd you do uh, oh, no, this is going to be a combat point, isn't it? Oh, I I got me some points. All right, bleed. Your blades are as sharp as your wit. And your normal melee attack now has a chance to make enemies bleed. Okay. Uh, cripple. Smashing and slashing melee now has a chance to permanently cripple enemies, significantly re re uh, reducing their movement speed. Meh. Uh, Uncharted series. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, how is the Uncharted here? I that game is so cool. Uh, melee damage increases slightly. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that one. That's a that's a nice general good thing to have. Um, and you're up to the third one. Good grief! Weren't you just playing? Um, oh, eh, eh, eh. Weren't you just playing the um, the 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 other game? The um, Forbidden West or something? I can't remember the name of it. I'm, my brain is 
jelly. <laughs> right, I'm just gonna try to power through these levels and see what happens if I just can get... Oh, okay, maybe not. Hey, what are you doing? Why am I facing? Stop! It kept turning me around for some reason. That was weird. Uh, the games are not particularly long, really. I, I've i never played the Uncharted series, so I don't know for sure. Oh, oh gosh. Quick. Die. Why are you... F okay, I'm pointing down. Why are you going up? Okay. Oh, I'm kind of getting... Kind of getting mushed. But we need to... We need to find... I'm, I'm hoping that the top screw is here, but this is literally just a guess. I have no idea. Oh, are we not? There we go. Oh. Uh. I don't know about you, but this seems like boss area, doesn't it? Oh, boy. Or maybe it's not. What the hell? Uh, apparently the fourth and fifth one are very long. Well, that's good. Oh boy. I think we're just going to go in. I'm kind of running out of time. And then he goes, <laughs> the aristocrats. <laughs> oh, it looks like you've got customers, Nash. I'll be on my way then. Oh, wait, it's Joe. Hey, Joe. Nash, <coughs> excuse me. Nash, you still got the old gun I used to uh, use to teach kids how to shoot? I do. Why do you ask? I'll give it to Joe, will you? You never use guns anyway. That is very true. And Joe could probably do with a bit of firepower. Joe, uh, <coughs> Joe, Nash is going to give you an old gun of mine. It's not much, but it's a start. If you happen to actually get any good at killing monsters, be sure to bring their trophies to me. Ah, ha, ha, ha. And I'll teach you how to spice up your crib, your crib a bit. I think she means your crib a bit. Anyway, I'm off. Have fun, Joe. See you later, Nash. See you later, Amelia. So... All that was to... Okay, to get to here... Hello, Joe! Step right up! Step right up! I've got lanterns, maps, ropes, bombs, anything and everything for the discerning adventurer. Uh, what is this place? Why, this is the temple, of course. Well, actually calling it a temple is slightly misleading. Uh, I, th I think of more, I think of it more as an ancient factory of sorts. A factory? Aye, a factory! When the first settlers arrived to Peachleaf, it had long since been abandoned. But upon further investigation, all clues seemed to point to it being not a place of worship, but a place of production. That's odd. Who built it? We're not exactly sure, but they sure knew a thing or two about construction. There's even a rather advanced elevator system that connects all the different floors. Personally, my theory is aliens. Why do you have a shop here? Well, the temple is brimming with monsters, and it attracts quite a few tourists. So with my know-how charm and world-renowned customer satisfaction guarantee, I really couldn't have picked a better spot. How's business? Some might say that the adventure genre is dead, but they couldn't be more wrong. Business is doing fantastic, thanks. Where do I go from here? You just take the elevator here to my left and... Ch over there. And choose where you want to go. You can't go directly to the deeper level, so... But the elevator only takes you to every fifth level, so... Make sure to try and make it to the nearest fifth level when you go exploring. What do you have in stock? Have a look! I only accept gemstones!
Got it. But as luck would have it, you'll find plenty of gemstones inside the temple itself. Got it. All right, so we have bombs, escape ropes. The attached grappling hook enables you to instantly yeet right back to the temple entrance. Nice. Consumed on entrance. Makes it significantly easier to see in the dark. Getting lost all the time. We got you. This map shows the, uh, the layout of the current t uh, level. Oh, this is useful. And of course, boom, baby, boom. Always a, always a, a handy thing. <sighs> Just because I'm curious. I can still sell stuff to him and get regular gold. Good to know. All right, so can it go here? And it brings me here. Hi, Joe. Gotcha. But what if I go here and I go over here? What's to here? What is this? What is this? Oh. All right. Um, it's time for me to get back home. But that's good to know. That's really good to know. So I don't have to fight my way through all those monsters anymore. I can just go straight there should I desire to. Good to know. All right, well, unfortunately, we really didn't get very far today. But at least now we know what these gemstones are for. I sold some of them not knowing what they were for. But now at least we have an idea. And also... All right, so stone, wood, and fiber. Okay, uh, oh. Could I build some of these things? Oh, look at that. I didn't even notice this. I might actually build this right now. Oh, I might actually build this right now. I can. Uh, I think I'll come over here. And yeah. Beehive. Good choice. A bee house will uh, house will slowly produce honey for you. Uh, oh, that's right. You don't have to do anything but wait, and you can simply collect the honey once it's done. Nice. So just free honey. I'm not gonna complain about that. All right. Okay, Greg, no worries, brother. Have a good one. And we're kind of running out of time here, so let's just go ahead and pop. Oh, should I sell anything? I actually don't really have much to sell. Just those crops I already did, so. Okay, good night. Do I, do I heal up if I go to bed too? Oh, thank goodness, some money. All right, I'm taking these seeds and I'm going to make some more. Uh, I, I'm going to buy some. Or, I mean, take this money and buy some more seeds. Wow. See, brain thinking goes on over here. And then then like the words I want to say, they kind of get over here. But then it all sort of spills here. And then it goes. Bleh. <laughs> Smash not talk good. <laughs> anyway. Anyone can be a monster